In this video, we are going to see how to set up a basic HTTP authentication. Download this file in the description. Open terminal. Copy this first command. And paste it here. Paste press control should be hit enter. Enter the password. Wait until it updates. update has been done copy the second command paste it and run it i already installed it that's why it's doing like this thing now we are going to set up a password copy this third command here Paste it in the terminal. Now change his last name. Your username in the Ubuntu system. Mine is engineer. After that, hit enter. Enter the password. You want to set it for a web page? Type password. Now, we will see what to do next. Now, we are going to see if the password is set or not. Copy this fourth command. Paste it in the terminal. Enter. We can see the password has been set. It's very cold. Now, we are going going to change this file copy this command paste it in the terminal hit enter now here scroll down until you find this error log something like this now here you need to paste the code this code exact same code don't change anything copy it Is press control shift V. Now you just pasted the code. Now press control X, press Y, hit enter. Now what next? After that, we need to restart the Apache server. Copy the command control shift V. If you get any error in restarting the Apache server, that means you have made mistake in this file. In this file, you made something mistake there in this file. So now we will continue this. This next open this files. Go to other locations. Compute computer where www html okay wait assume that there is no file here you will have only index html click on this and click on open terminal now type whatever i am typing edit i will give file name as hello dot h e m l enter now type the simple code to be on the page html hello 
Save the file and close it. Now close the terminal also. Now open Firefox. Close the whatever you have. Click on this gear icon here. Click on privacy and security. Clear data. Clear. Clear now. Now clear history. Okay. Now close the tab. References tab. Now type the local host slash hello dot html. Wait, don't hit enter now. Open a terminal and type sudo wire shark enter. Now click on any, right click, start capture. Now go to the website and click on enter. You need to enter the password and your username and password you just give there. Here, this is my username, which I gave it in the command. Where is that? The first uh, command I gave, where is this? I'll show you. The name you gave here is the username. Now password, the password you typed, after entering click ok, Don't save. you can see the page has been loaded, open Wireshark, I think everything has been captured, click on this red icon, red button, type HTTP, click enter, here leave the first one go to this leave the first html you saw which is uh, above the unauthorized go to the next first ah. just go on clicking the html pages until you find the basic connection like authentication you will not find in the first one definitely type http again http enter search for the second uh, packet capture by html Where is it? it is here click right click on that click on follow click on tcp now you can see here authorization basic This is the key. We this is the encrypted in base sixty four. We need to decrypt this. Copy this thing. Close this. You need to save this. Okay. You have to, you have to take the screenshot. Not this. When you type HTTP, you have to take the screenshot of this and. Also, this you have to take the screenshot of this also. Another browser, you will paste that thing here. Whatever you copied there, and we'll click on decode. Wait for a minute. Boom! Will show the engineer the username and also the password. But in our experiment, we need to learn how to do it. So don't use this online tool. I recommend you to learn about B64 tool. Uh, I think that's all for this basic authentication. We'll see you in the next PHP thing. That's a scary thing, PHP.